Hi, today I am talking about digestive system. NCRT page number 258. I will point out all the points in my torso model. Digestive system, digestion, the sim, the complex molecule break down into simple one is called digestion. First, see a overall point. This is mouth, tongue, nasal cavity, lungs, heart, liver, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, To see the esophagus, first remove the lungs and also remove the heart. You will see the esophagus. This is diaphragm. First talk about the gland. Three gland. Submandibular gland, sublingual gland parotid gland you can see a duct this is parotid duct it's called extension duct this is 15 centimeter in long not 15 only 5 centimeter in long location of parotid gland located near cheeks the extension ducts it's open into the vestibule just opposite the upper second molar teeth if infection occur here it's called mumps the parotid gland swollen up this is sublingual gland and dark name is duct of brevinus the name is come from the scientists who give the name duct. This is submandibular gland and duct is Watson duct. Both all the three salivary gland secret salivary salivary saliva. This is tongue and you can see cavity that oral cavity nose is nasal cavity here pharynx the common opening of nasal cavity and oral cavity is pharynx tongue present in oral cavity when you eat or chewing the food the saliva mixed with the food the food is called bolus. In mouth, we chew the food. Chewing the food, the food is called bolus. The pH of saliva is 6.8 and saliva contains amylase lysozyme. Here, certain type of drug can be absorbed. The bolus, the food, pass through esophagus by the movement of peristalsis by the movement of peristalsis in the esophagus the food come into stomach reviewing the liver now see all the part and name of stomach stomach is j shape and it long is 30 centimeter long and 15 centimeter wide location of stomach it's located in the upper left portion of the abdominal cavity this is abdominal cavity below the diaphragm is abdominal cavity upper it's thoracic cavity left side here stomach is present
ओके ना सी द नेम दिस इज कार्डिय रिजन एंड दैट पार्ट इज पांडास रिजन एंड दैट इज बॉडी पार्ट बॉडी पार्ट एंड दैट इज पायलोरिक रिजन बॉडी रिजन फांडास रिजन कार्डिय रिजन पायलोरिक रिजन यार कार्डियक इन इंस्पिक्टर यार कार्डियक इंस्पिक्टर इज प्रेजेंट यार पायलोरिक इंस्पिक्टर इज प्रेजेंट दैट इज क्रेटर कार्बेचर दैट इज लेजर कार्बेचर नाउ ओपन द स्टोमक You can see a fold that is rugi. That's rugi only see when the stomach is empty. No food is present in stomach. That is cardiac region, pancreas region, body region, pyloric region. When food come into stomach, ACL is secret, pepsin is secret. The pH of the stomach is one point eight. Here, water and alcohol is absorbed. The food containing stomach is called acid chyme. Then the food come into duodenum. Let's see the duodenum. This is duodenum opening, and you can see. is of figures of any the food coming to duodenum this is duodenum and here liver that attach the liver in duodenum the food is called kai this is liver this is left lobe this is right lobe and this is gall bladder this is falciform ligament this is a small intestine this is large intestine that part is jejunum and that part is ileum the food now come into a small intestine the jejunum when human died there is no food contained in jejunum A small intestine secret maltes here pH is seven point six and glucose fructose fatty acid glycerol amino acid are absorbed the through the ileum part of small intestine the food come into large intestine through ileocecal valve the this is ascending clone this is transverse clone and you can see this is descending clone and then pass out by rectum this is pancreas this is spleen pancreas secret trypsin amylase lipase procarboxypeptidase and etc this is pancreatic duct 
when food comes into duodenum, pancreas secrete pancreatic juice and liver secrete by the gallbladder mm, bile juice come into the duodenum. Now see the duodenum. This is duodenum. The secretion come here through the ampulla better. Now the food come into the small intestine. Then the food come into large intestine then pass through by rectum. In large intestine, water and some minerals are absorbed. You can see fold. This fold is hostra and there are three tinea coli that is band present. That region is hepatic plexure and that region is spleen that is mesentery that attach to help to attach the organ this is hostra and band called stenia coli if you cut the elementary canal Let's cut the esophagus or gut. You can see that is lumen and the outer part is serosa. The serosa is also called policeman of elementary gland. Made up of it's it is made up of squamous epithelium. Here Outer side is longitudinal and inner side is circular. Both together called muscularis. The muscularis is made up of smooth muscle. And you can see submucosa. Submucosa is made up of loose connective tissue and this is mucosa. In stomach, Muscularis have three layers, inner, outer and another is obligate muscle layer.